Aloe vera has a long history being used as a medicine and a skincare product. Today I'm going to show you how to use a, a fresh aloe vera and RT3000 to do the steam distillation to make your hydrosol. The first step is to slice uh, the aloe into a small pieces. Similar is better. You can see the alloy has a very clear, uh, the, like a jelly thing in the middle. After you put all the aloe vera into the column, make sure it fully cover the bottom so there's no steam bypass. Fill water into the pot. Put a column on the pot. Just untighten it. Is going to use an induction oven. Turn on circulation before turn on the heat. Make sure the circulation work uh, in good condition. Within 20 minutes, I got a 500 milliliter uh, aloe vera hydrosol. It smells very lightly. It's like a herb or grass smell. But this magic uh, hydrosol is very good uh, for skin, soothing the skin, anti-acne. If you have a redness or even eczema, it can help reduce that. And also, it's edible, so it's good for the digestion system. Add a little bit in your water and drink it if you feel like uh, your stomach uh, not comfortable. It can be used on young kids, even baby, during their, uh, the baths. So you add a little bit of hydrosol into the bath water, help uh, reduce their eczema, rash. Uh, today, I show you how to use uh, uh, the fresh aloe vera to do the steam distillation and make a hydrosol. This is Leo at the lead time. If you like the video, like it and share with your friends. See you next time.